So we have two dealerships, but we are both run by the same family. You know, most car dealerships these days are owned by large corporations. And when you come into a family-owned dealership and you see two brothers transition that ownership into three children on each side, it's something really special. Like I said, it's family. It was just fun for us as a kid. I would hang out with all the mechanics and the parts people. If my parents knew where we went on our bicycles, I'd be still in trouble today. <laughs> It was a family business, so after school, Steve and I would ride down the ramp in a, in a swivel office chair. 1926, that's you know five generations that we've been family owned and operated. I love our family history and legacy, and I'm proud that we've, we've kept it going. Employees had been there 40, 50 years. It was people you knew and people you trusted that worked for you. You go on the side, there's handprints in the concrete, little kid handprints, and that was Chris and Tammy and all them. Someone's been here a hundred years. There's a lot of pride in this store. We just continue to change with the times while working really hard to stay true to our core values. What I'm most proud of is the children. All six MBAs in the business. But it's not the MBA. I think it just teaches them more commitment, and that's really the reason we threw it out there, to see how many of them would really reach that high. Knowing what we're good at, what we're not good at, has actually worked to the benefit of being able to work together as a family. With all the change in the, the industry today and the big mega dealers that don't care, we hope to pass on that we do care. My kids come in after school and help just like I did. You know, seeing so many family members and knowing what we did to get to this point, the Cox commitment started with what we call the fifth generation of all of our cousins and siblings working together. We made a commitment to each other first. And by making that commitment to each other first, we can then make that commitment to our team and our team can make that commitment to the customer. They do right by their employees and they do right by the customers. I'm telling you, there's going to be another generation here to take over again. It's, it's tradition. It's what they know. It's what they do.